Too, didn't she? Come on, we'll go tell Uncle Henry and Annie Ann. Oh dear, I think he's gone away. Oh, Annie, just listen to what this ghost said to Toto. Oh, she. He's he's well. Oh, but Annie, she hit him. Oh, don't bother us now, honey. Can't you see this mare's poorly? We're, we're likely to lose her. How's it coming? What am I going to do about Miss Gulch just because Toto chases her old cat? Well, listen, honey, I got to take care of the goat. <laughs> oh, Hunk, what am I going to do? Now look it, Dorothy. You ain't using your head about Miss Gulch. Ain't you got a brain? It's like you don't have any brains at all. I have so got brains. Then why don't you use them? When you come home, don't go by Miss Gulch's place. Then Toto will get in the garden and you won't get any trouble, you see? Uh-huh. You just won't listen, that's all. Well, your head wasn't made of straw, you know. Oh! about Miss Gulch. Listen, kid, are you gonna let that old Gulch have a try and buffalo you? She ain't nothing to be afraid of. Have a little courage, that's oh. all. I'm not afraid of her. The next time she squawks, just walk up to her and spit in her eye. That's what I do. Well, I... Ah! Zeke! Zeke! Ah! 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 Are you okay, Dorothy? Oh, yes. I'm all right. Oh. Why, Zeke, you're about as scared as I am. <laughs> What's the matter, Zeke? You gonna let a little old bee make a cow out of you? Oh, Look Zeke. at you, Zeke. You're about as wise as... Here, here, What's all this jabberwalking? When there's work to be done, I know three shiftless farmhands will be out of work before they know it. Uh, but Dorothy was walking along I that edge. I saw you tinkering with that contraption. Now you and Hook, you get back to work right now. All right, Miss Gale. But one of these days, this town's going to erect a statue well, of me and... Don't start posing <laughs> right now. Here, here, you can't go working on an empty stomach. Have a crow. Oh, gosh, Miss Gale. Thanks. Well, you see, Dorothy was... Now, Dorothy has no right to be up there in that hayloft. Now, you go feed those goats before they work themselves to a knee mail. Yes, ma'am. And then, really, you know what Miss Gale says Dorothy, she was going to do? you've got to stop being so imaginative. My goodness, you're going to work yourself into such a tip. Now, look. You help us out today, and you find yourself a place where you won't get in any trouble. 
some place where there isn't any trouble. I suppose there is such a place, Toto? There must be. It's not a place you can get to by boat or train. It's far, far away. Skulked in my life, Miss Gulch. I ain't about to start now. I want to see you and your wife right away about Dorothy. Dorothy? What, what has Dorothy done? What's she done? Well, I'm all but lame from the bite on my leg. You mean, you mean she bit you? No, her dog. Oh, she bit her dog, eh? No. That dog's a menace to the community. I'm taking him to the sheriff and make sure he's immediately destroyed. Destroyed? Tono? Oh, you can't. You mustn't. Uncle Henry, Annie M, you won't let her, will you? Oh, of course not. Uh, will we, M? Oh, please, Aunt M. Tono didn't mean to. He didn't know he was doing anything wrong. I'm the one that ought to be punished. I let him get into her garden. You can send me to bed without supper. You hear how sorry this child is. Why, if she promises to give your place wide birth... If you don't hand over that dog right now, I'll bring a damage suit that'll take your whole farm. There's a law protecting folks against dogs that bite. Well, how about if she tie him up? He's quite gentle, with gentle folk, that is. Well, that's for the sheriff to decide. Here's his order allowing me to take him. Unless you want to go against the law. Mm. Well, we can't go against the law, Dorothy. No. I'm afraid poor Toto will have to go. That's more like no. it. Here's what I'm taking him in so he can't attack me again. No, 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 I won't let you take him. Will you go away? Well, I'll bite you myself. Oh, oh. Dorothy. You no, wicked see. old witch. Uncle Henry, Annie, I'm don't let her take him. Please don't let him take Toto, please. Put him in the basket, Henry. Well, that's more like it. Myra Gulch, just because you own half the county doesn't mean you have the power to run the rest of us. For 23 years, I've been wanting to tell you what I think of you. And well, being a Christian woman, I can't say it. <laughs> and uh, who might you be? No, 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 don't tell me you're rough. You're traveling in disguise. No, that's not right. You're, uh, you're uh, going on a visit. No, I'm wrong. You're running away. How did you guess? <laughs> Professor Marvel never guesses. He knows. But why are you running away? No, what? no, 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 don't tell me. They don't understand you at home. They don't appreciate you. 
You want to see other lands, big countries, big mountains, big oceans. <laughs> why, it's like you can read what's inside of me. <laughs> oh, please, Professor, why can't we come with you and see all the crown heads of Europe? You know any? Oh, oh. Oh, <laughs> yeah, you mean the thing. Well, uh, I never do anything without uh, consulting my crystal first. It's the same genuine magic, authentic crystal as it's used by the priests of Isis and Osiris in the days of the pharaohs of Egypt. Uh, you'd, uh, you'd best close your eyes, child. Uh, we can't do these kind of things without uh, reaching out into the infinite. Uh, yes, yes, uh, that's all right. You can open them again now. <laughs> we'll gaze into the crystal. What's this I see? A house with a, with a picket fence and a barn and a weather vane. That's our farm. Yes, and there's, there's, there's a woman. She's wearing a, a, a polka dot dress. Her face is careworn. That's Aunt Em. Yes, oh, her name is Emily. That's right. What is she doing? Well, I can't quite see. Why, 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 why she's crying? Yeah, uh, someone has hurt her. Someone has broken her heart. Me? Well, oh, I don't know, but it's someone she loves very much. Someone she's been very kind to. Someone she's taken care of in sickness. I had the measles once, and she stayed right by me every minute. Uh-huh, uh-huh. What is she doing now? Oh, no, what? What's this? She's putting her hand on her heart. She's, she's dropping down on the bed. Oh, no. What's wrong with her? Well, I, I can't tell. The crystal's gone dark. Oh, no. You don't suppose she could be really sick, do you? I've got to get home to her right away. What's this? I thought you were coming along with me. Oh, no. I've got to get to her right away. Goodbye, Professor Marvel, and thank you. Get under cover. Oh, there's a storm blowing. A whopper. Poor little kid. I hope she gets home all right.